Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Jalissa. My hair is looking a little bit crazy today. I have two clips because if not, my hair is just going to be all over the place. So yeah, don't mind this look that I have going on right now. I am totally feeling this like plum lip color right now. It doesn't say the shade name on here, which I'm like so upset about. But it's from Clinique. If you guys want to check it out, I just got it as a sample from Sephora. And I like really really like this lip color and it's like kind of like a lip balm. It's like super smooth and I just love it. Anyways, this video is not about that. This video is about straightening my hair. In today's video, I'm going to be comparing two very different hair straighteners. I mean, they're like very similar. They're just one inch hair straighteners, but the price difference is huge. This is kind of like my go-to hair straightener it's gonna be very hard to beat this one because i really like it but this one is 250 dollars and this revlon one which is also a one inch straightener is only like 25 dollars which is like insane if you're not subscribed go ahead and subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on your post notifications so you can get notified every time i upload a video and follow my instagram this is my instagram right here i post a lot of stuff on there that i do not post on my youtube channel so go ahead and check out my instagram we just hit 10k followers thank you so much i'm so excited so go ahead and check out my instagram show some love so i'm gonna part my hair into two sections i'm gonna actually do that right now i have no product on my hair right now and don't mind my hair i know i need a haircut i know the ends don't look perfect they're not like super curly how they should be but i want to get a haircut but at the same time i don't want to get a haircut because i'm like really enjoying my long hair so i don't know if i'm gonna get a haircut let me know in the comments down below if i should get a haircut so this side i'm actually gonna use my ghd platinum plus so i'm gonna spray a little bit of this prep rally spray from dry bar i love this spray and it's like perfect for right before a blowout right before straightening your hair it leaves my hair so shiny and it actually protects my hair from the heat so totally recommend i'll link it down below i'll link down below all the products that i mentioned i'm going to use my julie brush to detangle my hair before straightening it so if you guys want to check out my brush I actually have an Amazon store, so go ahead and check it out. I'm going to link it down below. I love this brush for detangling my hair. It's like very, very flexible, as you can see. It's like super flexible, and it doesn't pull my hair, so I love it. And by the way, if you won the giveaway last time, you got one of these. Just a little surprise, you know? <laughs> um, but yeah, I love this brush. It's, it's really, really good. Okay, so my GHD Platinum Plus is all warmed up, so now I'm going to straighten this section of hair so this is kind of like a big one but i'm gonna just try to do it by the way this only has like one heat setting it's like super interesting because you just press this button it just has one button i guess right now the heat setting is about 365 which is good because that's kind of like what i usually put my hair tools at around 365 400 so yeah that's what my hair is looking like so far it really straightens my hair so quickly and it doesn't pull my hair i i love this hair tool it's like really really nice i'm gonna use my brush again to just detangle this section i'm gonna take a small section and i'm just gonna straighten it i usually do like two or three passes right away on the roots and then just bring it down Guys, I want to know what type of video you would like me to film next. I have a couple of hair tools that I want to test out. So let me know if you want to see a hair tool video or if you want to see something else. I'm also going to get a new like workout machine that I'm like super excited about. And it focuses on the legs, the booty, you already know. So if you guys want a video about that, like kind of like a one month review of this specific machine let me know i'm just gonna start a timer just so you guys can kind of have an idea of how long it takes me to do one side at least with the ghd platinum plus so i'm gonna start it right now and i'm just gonna fast forward this side
Alright guys, I'm back and this is what my hair is looking like. So this is the GHD Platinum Plus side. It looks very sleek, very shiny, and I just really love how the GHD Platinum Plus works on my hair. It's amazing. It's kind of like my go-to straightener. So yeah, I love it. And my hair is like super soft, very shiny, very sleek. It actually took me about 23 minutes to do this side it usually takes me at least 40 minutes to straighten my hair especially when it's straight from curly hair because i do have to do a couple more passes like it takes a little bit longer so let's do this side so on this side i'm going to be doing the revlon straightener so this is the revlon copper smooth flat iron and this is the one inch flat iron i'm just going to do 380 380 i'm going to do 380 on this side and let's see how my hair looks i can't remember if i sprayed this on all my hair or just one half on this side so i'm just gonna add a little bit more on this side i'm gonna use my brush to detangle my hair It's actually not pulling my hair, which is nice. It's not bad. I'm gonna do this one, and then I'm gonna do both sections together. So here's the first section with the Revlon hair tool and I mean I think it's good so far. So far it doesn't feel as soft as the GHD side but it did leave my hair very straight and sleek. I mean, it is getting it pretty straight. I'm going to start the timer now for this side. I'm going to let you guys know how long it took me to do this side. Hey guys, I'm back. I finished this side of my hair with the Revlon flat iron and it did take me a little bit longer to do this side. I don't know if it's because this side of my hair is curlier than this side. It took me almost 28 minutes to do this side so it would probably take me about an hour to do all my hair with the Revlon tool. And this is what my hair looks like. I think it looks pretty sleek. Like it looks sleek for the most part but i do feel like the ghd side looks healthier and shinier like it looks more sleek more smooth um it's like very very shiny i kind of don't get that same shine on this side this side looks okay 
it's still shiny but it's not as shiny as this side i think i mean i don't know what do you guys think let me know in the comments down below but if you want something affordable that's going to get the job done that's going to work it's going to straighten your hair then i do recommend the rub on one it's only like 25 dollars but yeah make sure to let me know which side you like better do you like the rub on side or did you like the ghc side let me know in the comments down below i hope you guys like this video if you did make sure you give it a big thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on your post notifications so you get notified every time i upload a video i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys in my next video Mwah. bye bye <laughs>